Hi, how you doing? Matt Watson here from Carwang. Now I'm sat, actually people complain about my poor English. I should say, I'm sitting. Wait, what did you say? You just have to understand that I'm from the Midlands and we do tour proper there. We're right peaky blinders, we have. Blah, blah, blah. I'm sitting in a BMW X6M competition and next to me is a Lamborghini Urus. And we're gonna have a drag race. Now, can you guess who is in the Lamborghini? Hello, Bob, how are you? How is your Lamborghini? Is that Bob the Builder? Hi, Matt. How are you? My Lambo is tremendous as always. It's a Lambo, you know I love it. I like the look of your Lambo. What have you done to it? Bought the car about a month ago. Then I put the full Nero body kit with 24 inch wheels. And then I decided to put carbon PPF all over it. So it looks like a carbon car. Do you know what, Yanni? I'll give you this. This is one of your wraps that I really, really do like. It looks awesome. Thank you. It's actually gone down really well. Usually I'm a bit out there with my chromes and everyone's like, oh, he's ruined another car. But this actually has gone down really well. The thing is, Yanni, it's your Urus, but can you tell me the stats on it? What do you know about it? <laughs> I should actually do my homework on these cars, and you're going to get in the comment, he's one of them people that just drive the cars and doesn't know the stats. I do know the stats, but it's not my job to know the stats. My job is to buy the car, drive it, and enjoy it. He <laughs> just likes the look of him. The sensation he gets through his bottom. Anyway, let me tell you about your car, Yanni. So it's got a four litre twin turbo V8, 650 horsepower, 850 newton meters of torque. It's all wheel drive. It's got an eight speed automatic gearbox. You probably know it's automatic. Probably haven't counted the speeds up. It's not the heaviest for a big SUV, 2.2 tons. So I think that's Italian tons, a little bit lighter than German tons. I think the Italians lie a little bit about their weight. Or maybe your carbon fiber wrap is actually helping reduce the weight somehow. It's got the kit on it, so I'm worried about drag, top speed, or top end. The list price on it is £160,000, but I suppose you could tell me the actual price of all your car with all the work done to it. Go on. List on this was just under 210, and then with all the, the kit, the wheels and everything else, about 260. Okay, I'll let you sit there and probably go on your phone for a bit while I tell the guys watching about this BMW. So this has a 4.4 litre twin turbo V8, puts out 625 horsepower and 750 newton meters of torque so down on that lamborghini also it's heavier 2.4 tons though so these are german tons and probably more honest also this car is less expensive than that 113,000 pounds it's got all-wheel drive obviously and an eight-speed automatic gearbox with launch control but i know these bmws launch super hard so i reckon i might just be able to beat him in his urus let's find out but before we do the obligatory sound check so i'm going to rev this thing up oh look at that bit of a soft limiter but it's let me get up to five <laughs> i guess i'll take that it's better than an audi at least they stop you at three bet that lambo's louder Go on then, Yanni, rev up your Lambo. I'm hoping to win this one. Pop, 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 pop. Pop, pop. Clear win for Yanni. One nil to me. Now, before we get into the race, please make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you will not miss a single upload. Also, why don't you check out Yanni's channel, yeah? The link is in the description below. It's Yanni Mize. Loads of cool stuff on there. Love his channel. Love him in a brotherly kind of way. Pop, 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 pop. Anyway, let's finally get on with this. But before we do, one last thing. If you're thinking about buying a new car or you know someone who is, just Google, help me car wow, because me and my team are there to help you decide which is the right car for you and get it for a fair price from one of our trusted dealers. That's enough sales pitch. Let's get on with it. Buying a new car? Then head to car wow, and my team will help you find your next car at a fair price. Car wow, your one-stop car buying comparison site. Uh, Yanni, this is quite a big race. Are you a bit nervous because your car is lighter and more powerful, so you should win, especially if, as you say, you have a much better reaction time than me. Not nervous at all, mate. I've got faith in the ball that usually comes out of your mouth. He stole my line. I was going to just say that to him. Hope he doesn't steal this win. Three, two, one. Uh, I've him on the line. Oh, took a second to get away. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. Gain on him now. Come on. I had a bit of launch. It's going to be close as to whether I jumped it though. Oh. Poor launch. Whoa. 
either I jumped or you were slow, or I was on time and you were slow. Which one? I personally think I was slow, and I was debating whether to have my traction on or my traction off. And I went with off, I think. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I think I had a slight delay. I know we're gonna do it again though. Why are we doing it again? Because that's what we do on car, wow. Well, what happened? Do you want to go straight into the, so then what exactly happened? That means it's over, it means the drag's over. I'm about to turn around, let's go. <laughs> All right, let's do it again. Here we go. That's neck and neck off the line. I have that slight delay. Come on. This is a fair one. Oh, it's going to be so close. Come on. Come on, BMW. He's pulling it back. He's pulling it back. Or is he? Come on. Come on, come on. Do him on the line. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes, 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 yes. I think I over celebrated there. Pull the muscle in my stomach. Oh. So, yeah, and what do you think of that? Yeah, it looked like you beat me. I don't know what it is. I have this real split, split second delay as I pull away, and that gives you that slight advantage on me. We don't want to hear excuses. We want to just leave it on. Yeah, you beat me. BMW fanboys are going to love this video, ain't they? <laughs> <laughs> they are. Oh my God, it's going to be very, very moist in the comments, isn't it, from the BMW fanboys? I'm not a BMW fanboy, right? I know people say I am. I'm not. I will say one thing, though. We don't want to hear about that. I am running on 24-inch wheels, and usually these come with 22s or 23s. That could make that, that, that slight difference. Ah! Oh. I bet he's still making excuses now, but I just can't hear him, thank God. So then, what exactly happened? Well, both cars completed the standing quarter mile in 11.7 seconds. But this slow motion action replay reveals that it was the BMW X6M that crossed the line first. Okay, now we're going to have a rolling race, but we're going to have the cars in their comfiest settings. So I have to go through these menus, everything else into comfort, stability on, gearbox into drive. Yeah, and is your car set up? Are you like fully in comfort mode and automatic for the gearbox? Strada and auto. This then, on me, 50 miles an hour. Got a feeling you might have me here. All right, you ready? Three, two, one, go. What? Oh, what a delay. What is going on? actually is happening. In fact, I think I'm putting a lead on him. Right, that's it, mate, that's it. I'm sorry to say, your car is just like slower than this. What a delay, my God. I suppose he's in comfort mode, so it just went full on Italian, like, yeah, bella, and just chilled out. That was a dreadful Italian impression as well, but you get the idea. Yeah, it got to 150, but yeah, it was slow. Do you know what? Your enthusiasm seems to have dropped slightly. Why is that? I'm disappointed. What do you want me to say? I'm, I feel sad. I feel so sorry for him. <laughs> I want to give him a little bit of a hug, cheer him up. He's loving it over there. He's loving life. Smug, like a little Cheshire cat. Poor Yanni. <laughs> Next challenge. <laughs> now we're going to have another rolling race. What we're going to do is put the cars into their sportiest setting. So I double press this into a pre-configured setup here. Fully sport mode now. Going to have the gearbox in manual. I'm actually going to change the view of the dials. So it's easier for me to see when I need to change up because I don't want to fluff a gear change. So now, same again, 50 miles an hour, rolling race. I'll count it in. Come on then, let's go. Third gear. Okay, here we go then. Three, two, one, go. Oh, you shot off. Oh, come on now. Yes, finally won. I was a bit slow on my reaction, to tell you the truth. You ain't catching me either. No, full on the brakes now. Hey, you did better that time. Your car just shot off. Mine had a slight delay when I put my foot down. I think I was also a bit delayed at responding to my own countdown as well, but it's my own fault. 
Yeah, I'll take that one. There's no way I was gonna let you have a clean sweep on me. So I'll take this one and if I can beat the brake test as well. I know it's all about the drag race, but I'll take something from this. Actually, mate, just let's try that rolling race again while we're here, just quickly, just to see if it was me being crap, which is highly likely. You ready? Get level then, let's try again. Three, two, one, go. That's me, mate. We actually saw then that I was a bit slow to respond, so it wasn't as bad, but his car was definitely quicker in the rolling race when he got all of its sporty settings. Let's crack on with this brake test now. <laughs> Come on, let's just go straight into it. When we reach the line, full emergency stop from 70 miles an hour. Come on, BMW. I know he's on carbon ceramics. Oh, come on. No, I won that. That's me. No! Ah! <laughs> Do you know what? There's a line that the cars are straddling, right? My ass is in front of the line, and I think his ass is behind the line. I've won that, mate. That's me. I saw you shaking and jumping up and down. That's me, mate. The back of my car's further back than yours. No, don't worry, don't worry. I'm not trying to steal it from you. I was jumping up and down and shouting because I'm a bit disappointed because it was so close. And you can quite easily see with the line that my bum's in front of it and yours is behind it. So yes, Yanni, you won. Don't worry, I'm not taking it away from you. I do have one of the biggest production brakes though, let's be honest. So I did expect it to stop. Rolling racing gear to you, brake test to you, but drag race and normal rolling race to me. And like you say, drag race is what matters. And I can't believe this beat the Urus in the drag race. This car just launches so well. Now, if you've gone to CarWow, you can see how much money you can save on one of these BMW X6Ms, and it's quite a lot. In fact, just click on the pop-out banner up there and you can check out the saving right now. It makes it really good value in a way, especially considering the performance it's got. Now, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on. That way you will not miss a single upload. Don't forget to follow Yanni on his channel, Yanni Mize. Link's in the description below. And why not check us out on Instagram, CarWow. Dead simple. Hope you all enjoyed the video. I did, especially because I beat his Aurus in a drag race. Yeah. I enjoyed that. <laughs> oh, that felt so good. <laughs>